About the curry. Did you use sardines because of the printies? Yeah. I just wanted to have sardines. It was a simple request. They're useless. But they order food like they're one of us. Seafood curry is too luxurious for them. Speaking of curry, the ingredients you use speak volumes about your households. We don't eat meat in my household, so we make a vegetable curry with tomatoes and eggplants. Of course, my household is luxurious, so we, ma we made a golden, a golden curry out of golden with gold dust. I don't think gold dust is an ingredient. Red Magnus's curry is super massive. He doesn't bother with vegetables or rice. He pours curry on top of a hundred kilogram super steak. Red Magnus calls it super steak curry. Does that even count as curry? Instead of steak curry, it's more like a, a curry steak, but it does sound kind of good. That trick with the yellow thing used, ninja rabbit technique, was super cool. I could do it, don't you think? Huh? How can you arrive at that conclusion? I can't possibly imagine. What are you saying? If a printy can do it, there's no way a red magnus can't. It, is that so? Then, please show me. Alright, are you ready? What? Ready? Huh? What? Hey, Sarah! Your dad is a beer belly. Yeah? It's complete. Super ninja rapid technique. Body switcheroo. That wasn't a body switcheroo. It was more like a scapegoat. Ah. Uh. That's funny. What? Did something super funny happen? Tell Red Magnus too. Oh, I didn't mean funny like that. You're all demons and overlords, right? Overlords, right? Yeah, Red Magnus is an overlord of Scorching Flame, known and feared for being violence incarnate. Aren't you a little too calm for that? What did you say? The same goes for Killian and Serafina. You're all missing the impact I expect from demons. I thought you'd be reckless for no reason and make terrifying sounds like normal demons would. Is that normal? From what I know. Alright, then it's act more like demons and start destroying everything! Oh, how demonic! Let's go! <laughs> yes, yes, that sounds good! This is being a demon! Keep it down! <laughs> ah. I will not hold back on, on those who disturb my beauty sleep. Now that's a demon. Rustling bacteria. Serafina, may I ask you something? Fine, what is it? You are the Overlord of Gorgeous, correct? Yes, indeed. Why do you keep asking me? Is something bothering you? Gorgeous is the richest netherworld in the entire universe. You have countless riches. Why are you so stingy? It's very rude to call a lady stingy. Could you please call me an economist? You're missing the point. What I'm asking is if it's even necessary to economize. What? The lost are invading here too. I didn't expect this, but at least it gives us a reason to fight in the munch room. Yeah, I didn't want any part of the fight over the curry. Finally! All right, let's have some fun! Hey, you lost your bronies! Red Magnus, the Scorching Storm Overlord, who makes crybabies piss their pants, will super take you on! It'd be kind of funny to hear the, uh... The background recon of the uh, like the scouts from the Lost being all like, "How'd they get here so fast? It's like they knew we were gonna get here before we even got here." And like it turns out, like it's just because we were chasing Curry. This effect does nothing. Nothing. All nothing. All the wow. There's a lot of enemy units on these. So I'm probably gonna go attack these guys and throw it over there if I can. All right. Let's give that a shot, then. 
I'm gonna say, Logan, move over here. And we'll summon... How far can... who can... Uh, probably Red Magnus can throw the furthest. Yeah. That's probably the way to go. So... Logan, lift, Red Magnus. It's going to throw him to this tile, which does attack plus 50%. Alright. Bam! And I can actually move over here, too. Not a lot of reason to, though. I can't do any specials, though. Ah! If I move a little bit over here, they can't surround me, at least. Like they'd probably want to right now. Additionally, just send someone else out there. Let's see. I'm trying to think of this. You can move this far, Kilia. So I'm gonna want to try to destroy it if I can. Oh, we should actually send Seraphina out there, huh? That's what we'll do. I'll position Kilia to be attacked. But Seraphina is gonna be the one that tries to throw. Let's see. I might need an extra character. Wait, can I attack it from here? I almost can. Yeah, that's the whole point of using Seraphina is that she can. She has an enhanced throw range, so. I mean, attack range. So send Seraphita down here. Red Magnus go over here to block direct attacks, at least. And you attack the change color. Bam! Time for that combo chain. It's gonna give them a, an attack bonus, but it applies to everybody, so it's not that big of a deal, really. And it gives me that not that much of a combo bonus. Alright, well, it's something. It's something. I wonder how the, how the uh, bonuses work out numerically, because I'm starting to think that they might be different. I think that the I think getting to the first level might require more points than getting the subsequent levels does. Can I, can I move further? Oops. I can. All right. So she's gonna be right out in front, but I think it's that's not much damage. That's not much damage at all. How about you hang out inside the portal for a turn? That's probably the way to go. Yeah, let's let them attack me. Let's let them get their attacks off. Well, I'll, I'll probably counterattack them anyway. Oh god, that's a lot of damage. That's more damage than I was expecting from them. Alright, here come the counters. Amnesia Mushroom's grown. He's still doing okay, lots of hit points. These guys are all level 16. Alright, that's just all the more... Not, not you. Christo. That's just the reason to bring out my healer. Really quick though, Headler. Trying to think of your attack range. Why, do I, why am I going there? I can do it here. Attack ranges, nothing. All right, so it's still single target. Okay, this would be a good place to put uh, Red Magnus, actually. Well, I can get out of here somehow, but I can't. All right, is there? Do I have an AOE? I kind of don't, do I? All right, I just have to pick a target then. Red Magnus can go over here though, and could be all like Wild Crescent and hit those two characters. That guy won't be dead though. Which is why I should... Ooh. Hang on a second, we can do something fun here. I just remembered this cool ability. The AoE defensive skill. It's out of range. Oops. Gotta move a little closer then. This is, such a, this is actually a really cool ability, because it's an AoE that uh, protects someone who's being surrounded, basically. And it looks like it might be helpful to still do an attack, so... Red Magnus, get ready to attack this guy with your yo-yo trick. Or Lariat, actually. Yeah, let's keep leveling up Lariat. I like that I use that skill a lot, so it's, help it's helpful to keep getting making it more powerful. And you... can attack the one character that's, that's over here that probably won't be dead yet. And that should pretty much wipe these dudes out right away. Oh, right, but I need a healer. Forgot about Christo. That part of my plan. Which is, let's heal up Kilia, because he's not doing the best all of a sudden. There we go. It's my turn. Oh, two down. That worked out. We got more da we got more damage than initially uh, expected, so Kilia didn't have to do his attack at all. Wait, did I tell him to do an attack yet? Actually, can't remember a little bit. 
Uh, so we have these characters. I feel like ideally we would barricade... We'd want to put our characters on the tile so that they can get the attack bonus. Let's see. Just get you towards the fight real quick. Just gonna start summoning people real quick. Logan's so handy for throwing. There we go. Get these characters that are worth summoning into the fight. Now that the first part of the situation is resolved. There we go. Don't necessarily want them running ahead, so they'll stay put for the moment. Yeah. Any enemies coming my way? A shrink mushroom. Alright. I mean, you can have fun with that. Yay! And now they were tiny. The end. Don't even know how long it'll last, but it was just kind of fun to do. Um... Logan might get attacked now, actually. We'll see how it goes. Let's try to get... Red closer to where I want him to be. Not quite as far as I'd like him to go. But he's heavy. And he, hey, he made it to the actual spot, at least. Ideally, I would get some melee characters in here to barricade the place up, basically. This isn't really a melee character necessarily, but he's like the next person to put there, more or less. Really, that's the first you can get, Serafina. Alright. Let's get her across. Did you just- I think I was able to throw her further than the character could actually move on her own. There we go. And... I guess I'll tell you guys to defend. I want to see if I can trick them into coming after me, because my characters are all on the uh, attack bonus tile. So it would be handy if they came for us. There we go. Ooh. They're specifically in the pattern that my AoE can land on. And they're mostly debuffing us. Another shrink mushroom. Alright, so... You can do your, spe your spear attack attack two of them. Are we? In, are they in range for your square-shaped attack? Because that'd be great. Oh, they are? Oh, is that one out of, out of the height difference? That's a bummer. I'll take it, though. And I think I can I can afford to move right now. Ah! Uh, but I'll be moving into the attack uh, the attack range. Oh, wait, no. If I go right here, I'm, not, I'm safe from the... No, I'm not. I'm safe, I'm safe from her square attack, but not the other one. Does she have better options at all? She has the star-based attack. The lion based attack. No, the Zeal Regen's probably one of the better approaches. Ah, uh, let's compare damage. Oh, I, I can't even reach it from here. So, Zeal Regen's the way to go for the moment. I'll let their attacks go first. Because then I can bring in Red Magnus. It's less combo, but Red Magnus will be able to deal with less attack in a moment. If they survive. So, I want Red Magnus to go in and hit whoever's left, but I don't want him to get hit by these attacks. And they're all still alive. Barely, but still. Alright. Well, I have a solution for that ability. Uh, Wild Crescent. Pretty much the way to go. Unless I want to specifically... Ah! Uh, if I do Lariat from here, it's probably better off. Yeah, it'll kill both of them. And you can finish off this guy over here. Inflict poison on all enemies within five panels. Not really necessary at the moment. Let's just finish this guy off real quick. Boom! There we go. Everyone's taken care of. Everyone's happy. And you're in the way in the back, aren't you? Let's try to cover some ground here. Not a, not a lot of uh, healing to do at this point, I don't think. But let's get my characters into the actual again. Wait, our move is... Oh yeah. I can still move this turn. Let's try, let's try to lure them into the area. If we can. Since hanging out in this corner doesn't do us a lot of good. You already done moving? You can only move like one tile. Right, you already moved. Alright. 
What type of po what type of mushroom is this? Amnesia mushroom. Logan, have fun. How do you it's okay if you get knocked out. You're only you're only here to throw some things, and you're already done with that kind of. So we. All right. Now they're amnesiaized and shrunken. Amnesiaized is not a word. I also don't know what amnesia does in this game. I think it makes you forget your skills. Someone was amnesia had amnesia before and they couldn't do any actions, so maybe they would forgot their skills. Logan's probably gonna get obliterated in a moment. Not too worried about it though. Ooh, they're on a line. They all got in a line and did not attack. Oh, I can I can use that. I can use that for sure. Let's see, do I have a line of base attack? Only the three. You also have a two. Are you the one that has the longest range attack? Exploding Tiger is three. Oh, Impaler drops four. So I want to get in, ra in range for that attack. Let's see. Huh. I need someone who can reach Kilia properly. Can you reach Kilia? You can. <laughs> Sound! Stairs are hard. Uh, uh, uh. You have Montas, right? Yes, you do. Alright, so you're going to lift Kilia, and you're going to Montas retcon over there. That's just a violent throw. And you're going to throw Kilia right where I want him to be. And Kilia is going to obliterate like Exodia. And that's not as much damage as I was quite hoping for. But it's at least something. Alright. You also have an AoE. Astral Break can attack right in front of you, too. Three in a row. That'd be handy. Though you also have... Not so much, actually. When you're big, I think you have a bigger AoE. Let's see. This character could use some a bonus experience, so I think I'm gonna go with them. Let's see here. Trying to create a chain reaction here. Right there, right there, right there. Right there. So you lift Argona. You move up here a little bit. You lift Christo. You move up here a little bit. You lift Seraphina. Throw Seraphina over here. All right, this required maybe fewer steps than I than I used. Uh, that's fine. Throw Dargona over here. She might get killed, but it, this, this will probably be good for experience to do this attack. Hey guys, that's not very strong. Oh well. We're doing something. We're gonna have fun with it, you know? We're gonna have fun with it is what's gonna happen. Do you have any specials at all? You have Phantom Blow. Only really low accuracy, no damage attack right now, basically. Yeah, if you attack them, it looks like you're not even gonna hurt them because you're level 6. Maybe if I stand here, there'll be an obvious target, though. Let's see. Yeah, might as well just keep them caged in so the attack works out, at least, for now. There we go. How's that for some damage? And no one died. Not the best news. Alright, I'm sorry, Dargona, you might be in trouble. I can move over here, though, so you can't get surrounded. Although that also opens Christo for being more attacked. Oh, right! Three of them, three of them are paralyzed. So th these characters are confused, amnesiatic, and paralyzed. So, yeah, not a lot's gonna go on here. Now they're paralyzed for two turns. Because, uh, Kilia has stuff equipped. I don't even know if you can look at, at uh, Innocence from here. But, uh, so he, he has stuff that gives people, like, paralysis and amnesia and a bunch of other different status effects to make his attacks more effective. Just by in inciting chaos. Ow. Well, one hit's all it took for her. Ow. Not a sleep mushroom, you say. I don't think I can reach it, though. Nope. Not quite. Alright, well, they're, st they're still here, so let's go ahead and do... Exploding Tiger. That'll finish them off. And then in your case... If you're right here and you attack him, you'll chain with uh, Kilia, right? No, you won't. Oh, 40% chance. That's something, at least. I'm just trying to, I'm trying to attack, uh, cause a combo here if I can. I'm just trying to introduce the highest possible chance of doing a combo. Here, do you have a high chance now across the board? Yeah, everybody. Cool. 
That'll probably kill him, right? I actually forgot to check the time, the, the uh, damage chance. It'll mostly kill him. The combo will probably kill him. There we go. Now they're all down. Not revenge mode. Oh, crap. I queued up my attacks in the wrong order, so she just did it. Well, that was slightly disappointing. Um, Doppelganger? Will you do damage to that guy? Target's too high up, probably. Esquire. Overload is accuracy and invasion for the unit, the team. Let's just get over here. Try to get in the right spot for Red to be able to fight next. Oh yeah, we could, we could totally throw that at somebody next. That'll be fun. Hey guys, how you doing? Uh, I think I'm just gonna throw Kilia into the fray. Just throw him right up here. Hey buddies, how you doing? Just gonna make a mess of you. Are you scared right now? You should be scared right now, because I'm right here, and I'm scary. Um, let's pick up Logan and throw him closer to the, other t the rest of the team so he can just throw more people directly into the fray. I'm getting throw happy right now. Let's find out if they can kill Killian one turn or not. Ow. Ow. Whoopsie. Ow. Amnesia Mushroom. Alright. We can have fun with that, probably. It's probably not in range. Wait, what's this one? A shrink Mushroom. We can have fun with that. Logan, go! I'm gonna lift it! Oh, yeah. Did that affect... Oh, it affected Kilia too. Didn't know if that was going to be how it worked out or not. Um, I want an AoE to happen. So I'm going to see if I can get said AoE to happen by lifting Red Magnus. Then Mon tossing them over as far as I can up here. Then you throw Red Magnus over here. And Red Magnus is all like, I got a, yo dog, I got a wild crescent. I don't know if that's going to work out for you. Uh, and these two people have more hit points. Let's fix that. Uh, not lift. Oh, Killy can't do any specials? Is it because he's shrunken? Is that Does that make you not be able to do specials? I was going to do that cone-based attack. Oh, wait, did I already attack this turn? Forget. Did that happen this turn? I don't remember. No, I don't think I did that yet. Alright, Serafina. Can you do anything from down there? Like, attack? Nope. Alright, Retcon. Let's help... Let's help Seraphina get somewhere. Oh, cool. You can throw her up here. That's perfect. Alright. Special. Dare I do this? Oh, yeah. That'll work perfectly. So, attack all around Red Magnus, which is fine, because Killia's gonna get out of the way. Tiny, tiny Killia. <laughs> Only one of them survived. Well, it happened. Being beautiful the See, the last remaining guy's gonna be in trouble. But Magnus, you still have a move? Yeah, you do. Get up in his face, scare him. Just scare him a little bit. You can move too. Get over here, maybe? Ah, uh, get in more attack range, I guess. But not don't go right behind him, because some of these characters can AoE, so I'm specifically not putting people right next to each other. To avoid that eventuality. A sleep mushroom. Yeah, I'm not getting that. <laughs> I'm not, not going to reach that. Um, Christo. Might as well heal the party. Even, it's not, even though it's not necessary, just because it levels things up. I'll support you. Yay, support. We all support each other because we're anime friends, and that's how you win at, at the anime stories, is to be friends with people and befriend all your old rivals, and then you'll run on adventures together. Anime. Um... <laughs> Let's make a mess of this guy. It's, I'm kind of sad I can't go into Titan mode. Oh my god. There's some damage. There is some damage indeed. You know what? How, how far can I move, actually? Oh, I can, throw, I can go over here. Let's just get, uh... Serafina into range? Killia into range. Serafina into range? If she attacks from here... 
we should be able to trigger a combo. Yeah, that'll probably finish him off. Owie! Owie! No combo. Just hitting him twice was enough. Too much thinking done. Uh, oh. 737 bonus hail, cafe, our light, and 100 experience. Ooh, and two levels, two level ups just from bonus experience alone. Please, spare us! We were scared of Lord Void Dark. We had no choice but to join the Lost. We didn't want to fight, but if we resisted, we would have been killed. We're victims of Void Dark too. Oh my! Lying is a sin. Were you not using the name of Void Dark to profit off of others and suck their sweet, sweet nectar? That. Nope. You're out. You guys need to be punished. What kind of sentencing is this? Well, of course! They're being sentenced to a tower throw! Alright! Let's super go! Ah! Well, that takes care of them! You're cool with them, right? Yes. As word of the Rebel Army spreads across the universe, other netherworlds may join us. Please do that more often. Nice! Then Red Magnus says, let's super turn it up even more! Huh. Does anyone know where Sarah went? I thought she was just with us. Maybe she got tired of dealing with all this and left. Billion hell? Did Father sink more money into that thing? Yep. Ever since you left, he's been pouring money into it like he's got it on top, dude. Is it okay to let him continue? You might want to return soon, dude. <laughs> Do you really think a mere two billion hell will have any effect on the economy of one of the richest netherworlds? There is nothing to worry about. Nothing. Nothing. 